So, dude, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just preparing for our live coverage event of the iPhone 3G on July 11th at the Apple Store. So, what what website is that going to be broadcasting on again? Oh, just www.stickum.com slash geog. Wait, which one? Hmm? Oh, www.stickum.com slash geog. Wait, one, one more time. Oh, www.stickum.com slash geog. Alright. Dude, I'm kind of getting hungry. You want to get some pizza? Yeah, pizza sounds good, but I don't know any pizza places around here. Oh, don't worry. I got my iPhone. What iPhone? The 3G one. When did you get a 3G iPhone? Three months ago. How, how did you get an iPhone 3G? Dude, thing? it's okay. Steve Jobs likes me. I've been a beta tester for the past three months. Dude, that's sweet. Alright, yeah, let me just look it up on my iPhone. 3G. Alright, so yeah, search for uh, pizza. Yeah, that's it right there, dude. Alright. So are you going to get it, or should I? Oh, no, I got it, dude. With the new GPS feature on the iPhone 3G, it should just take me right there. Woohoo! Dude! Whoa, you brought the pizza! No, I didn't bring the pizza, my iPhone brought the pizza. Wait, what do you mean? What can GPS do for you? Hey guys, this is Rajesh. And this is Marshall. Now you've probably realized that based on our last video and this one, that we've sort of highlighted the two main, the two biggest changes for the iPhone 3G. But you're going to be able to see a lot more if you tune in July 11th for our live iPhone 3G coverage all the way from standing in line at the Apple Store up to the unboxing which we will have uh, within 24 hours of us getting the iPhone. Now what was that website again Marshall? Um, I'm pretty sure it's stickum.com forward slash geo. Wait can you say that one more time? Stickum.com forward slash geo. And one last time I didn't really catch that. It's, it's just stickum.com forward slash geo. There you go guys, stickem.com forward slash geog.